Hi guys! I'm hoping this is already up. There you go, now we're live. Um, hi, this is me, Dr. Shalon Shachaf. Did you miss me? I missed you. Uh, the challenge went by quick, crazy quick, and um, I did enjoy a much more, you know, much quieter week, back touching base with my, you know, one-on-one -on -one coaching clients and planning and plotting some more things for you. But I did want to jump up here to say, uh, well, a couple of announcements. First of all, you might have noticed that, um, as I as I said, I was always going to do. I removed the challenge um, sessions now from the Facebook group. Um, so you know, I hope that you were able to benefit from them. But uh, stay tuned here for more information on how you can actually still get access to this challenge. Uh, to these, um, I'm going to put a couple of links uh, right here in the comments as we're uh as i'm broadcasting these so hang on just a second all right there you go i actually oh no it i don't want to end the live video okay so it's not letting me do comment without ending the live so i will put it in the comments later okay so what i was going to put on in the comments and maybe it's in the comments are um one um information about how you can go on and sign up to my email list and uh for uh this one time if you're going to sign up for my email list uh later on this weekend i will be emailing everybody that joined the email list with the um links with the replays if you still didn't catch the you know if you if you've not had a chance to watch all this uh, challenge sessions and you still want to benefit you can join the um subscribe to my email list i promised I, I i try not to spam on this i know during the challenge there was a lot of emails because each day i was sending replays and each day i was you know sending the workbook again uh but i really try to keep it to minimum so i hope that you guys would want to subscribe and at this point in time by subscribing you can get the um links to re-watch the channel sessions so that's one thing um another thing and this actually is going to um you know another thing i was posting in the comments uh, i was posting there the uh, links to my um my my summer programs that are still enrolling and i have two programs um but i want to talk about this in relation to a question that I've been getting from people. I've had a couple of um, people, it's a kind of reoccurring comment and question that people say, you know, we took the challenge and we, you know, we were naming things for ourselves and we really, we started writing, but then a week went by and we're back kind of where we started and people are feeling stuck again. So I really, I thought that that was a great opportunity to talk a little bit about why we relax, you know, why it's, um, what what's, What's the hang up and what's the difficulty? And here's, you know, here's the, here's the dirty truth about this. You can change your writing life. You can make a difference that's going to be a lasting difference. Um, but you cannot hope to do this without putting in, you know, a little bit of work, the, the, the footwork, the leg work, right? And, um, and that is because, you know, the habits that you have, the habits that you build, you've built them, however old you are today, you've built them that many years, right? Uh, I'm 46. The habits I've built, I've built over, you know, I'm, I'm con you know, we continue to build them a little, even when we're trying to, to create a new habit, right? So it takes time. It takes time and it takes mindful attention and you can't hope to build a new habit uh, because building a habit actually has a physical manifestation in your brain. If you look at, you know, the brain science, and again, can't recommend her enough. I always recommend uh, Around the Writer's Block where Roseanne Ben really explains our brain, or, you know, our plastic. We have neuroplasticity, and this is why we can build a new habit. But the only way to build a new habit is to consistently, continuously, uh, lovingly, mindfully, and patiently do the work right and, and and just build the habit and you're building new neuropaths in your brain and that takes time um another thing that it can take it, it's you know we we 
we, I myself am like that. We love thinking that we can do it all by ourselves, right? Uh, okay, and you know, I've watched these videos and now I can do it because I've watched it online and you know, I can, I can build a habit myself. But science, research, all of these things, you know, demonstrate that it's really, uh, it's really actually very hard to do it by yourself. Like we are social beings. We need support, we need community. And so it really helps if we can do this kind of work in a group setting and, or if we could do it, you know, by getting um, loving, focused attention uh, from somebody who's guiding you. So with all that said, uh, you know, I really do recommend because I believe, of course, in what I do. I really do recommend for those of you who are considering maybe you're on the fence. Um, I recommend considering taking my workshops. I have the uh, in July, I have two opportunities. One is a little bit more expensive and it's more of a deep dive in vision for, you know, if you have that uh, a, a way to set up a whole week between July 11th and 16th. Um, to really just do a deep dive. Um, you get a lot of focused attention from me in that uh, one. You know, you get a lot of one-on-one -on -one training. Uh, there's a whole day set aside for one-on-one -on -one training. A lot of workshop, we go through all the interventions and hacks, but it's very interactive and you get, uh, you know, everybody in the group can get a lot of, um, you know, when you, when you really focus over one week, you can get a lot done in, in a short period of time. But if that retreat is very, you know, too expensive for you or you can't, you know, allocate a whole week for this, I really do recommend that you look into, and again, this is going to be in the comments if it's not already, into the accelerator program that I put together. It's the budget option. It's, you know, it's, it's the, uh, I'm, I'm very happy that I was able to actually, you know, offer it on such a reduced price. And I think I can do it because, you know, I'm assuming a lot of you that might be joining this actually took the challenge. So in a way, we set the foundation um, and, and hopefully, you know, those who will join this uh, have watched the challenge or watched my videos. And then that accelerated program is still spread out over more time, over four weeks. Uh, it is designed to require of you the minimum amount of investment in terms of your both your money and your time. And I know that it can still seem like a lot of money to you. Uh, I'm not trying to dismiss, you know, that, that fact, but you know, you're paying for tuition, you're paying for God knows how many things in order for you to be in school. Uh, it is worthwhile, if I might suggest, right, to invest in yourself, taking these classes can really make the difference between, you know, you having a really hard time uh, at it with your writing or you taking the time to invest in creating these really healthy, inspiring habits that are going to allow you to, you know, bring forth your brilliant ideas. I don't know why Facebook does this thing with the light all the time, excuse me. So anyways, um, so to answer your, you know, those questions, you know, why do we relapse? First of all, you know, when you do, you know what I'm going to say, don't be hard on yourself if you relapse. I mean, I've been doing this work for, God, a decade, the unblocking work. I still relapse when I have a deadline, when I'm stressed, when, you know, my back is to the wall. You know, it's not like you ever get completely over the, the you know, those basic things like trying to avoid what you don't want to do until it gets too late and then you're like rushing to the deadline. I mean, it still happens. The difference is, you know, when you can teach yourself and train yourself to catch yourself doing it, um, you know, it, it gives you the advantage of being able to stop yourself, name what's going on, uh, you know, map your anxiety loops as they happen and, you know, stop, drop and roll, as I always say, and, and, and remind yourself that there's a better way, a, a more gentle way, a more supportive way, a more self-compassionate way to do the thing. So I invite you again to, uh, you know, if you have any more questions about any of the programs that I'm enrolling in, um, um, there are still spots in, all, in both these programs, right? So we have the one week retreat and then we have the accelerated workshop um, that even, oh, I, I know another, so another question that I've been getting from people considering this is like, well, you know, it's July and it's the last month I have this summer and I have chapter four, five, six, seven, eight, right, due. And I don't know that I can, take the time to do this work. So to that I will say, 
I have not seen anybody taking this class and not immediately beginning to, even if they take the deepest dive into their writer's block, it immediately releases so much of the anxiety uh, and people start making progress. Uh, you can look at the, uh, you know, the, the information that I, you know, had uh, added here, the links um, to the workshop. And there are uh, testimonials from people who took the workshop. Uh, and these were people that, you know, are sharing how blocked they were or, you know, what the difficulty was and how, as they took this workshop, you know, they now have articles out that they were stuck on for years or, you know, they finished writing uh, a book proposal that they were kind of stuck on forever or, you know, whatever it is. So, yes, I know it may seem counterintuitive, but I promise you, once you are, you know, when you put the investment into thinking about your writing, it pretty quickly starts releasing the anxiety. And the anxiety is really a lot of what stands between you and your writing, right? So with that, um, I wanted to just say, oh, there was another thing I wanted to say. Um, right, so the, when you take the class, you get to see other people too, so the community, you get to see other people are in your situation, you get to uh, forge this accountability community with other people we start looking actually at your actual you know you are invited to bring your actual specific uh text which we couldn't do in the challenge right you, you you're bringing in your project you get to talk through you know wherever it is that you're stuck uh, in your project you get to bring it in and and workshop it and talk. We, we we encourage i encourage that in fact because it needs to be relevant for you right so all of these things happen when you when you take one of the paid programs that you know cannot really happen in the in the free uh, challenge, and then you really get a hands-on, step-by-step um, guidance on how to make the habits work. So you know, we, and there's so many other tricks and hacks and things that, especially in the area of crafting and getting a draft from start to finish, that I was not able to uh, you know to cover in a seven-day challenge that's quick. Um, so we introduce these things. We send you home, home, right? Because we're doing everything from home. We send you home to practice those things. You go ahead and you try what, you know, you thought, you know, we, we introduce different things and out of those variety of things, you're like, I think I'm going to try the index card method from whatever, Kenneth Atchie's book. And then you come back to your the group, you know, a lot of people come back to the group and like, ah, it didn't work. Or, you know, when I tried this, this happened, etc. And so then you get to get the feedback loop. You know, I'm on the group, other people are on the group that are trying the same thing. And this is where you really can uh, get, you know, to own, to, to get ownership over these practical um, solutions and those practical tips and hacks and all of the things that I'm introducing as you put it to work, working on your project. So this workshop is never about you leaving, you know, whatever chapter of your, of your dissertation or article or book that you're working on outside, right? You are invited to bring your own project, your own thing, and workshop it. And everybody in the workshop are going to end up, you know, knowing more about your research, etc., cetera, uh, because you're going to get to do that when you are in the workshop. So with that said, uh, I just wanted to say, look at the comments. You can sign up for my email list to get um, another opportunity to re-watch the challenge uh, sessions. Um, I cannot promise that this would be, it's, it's not going to be forever access, but I'm going to give you a week or two more to be able to go through that program, which is a completely free program. Uh, and I'm really proud of, and I'm getting a lot of feedback from a lot of you saying that you really enjoyed it and it, you know, you're benefiting. Um, so I'm, you know, you sign up for the email, you get this. Um, I promise not to spam you too much, but I might send, you know, the information about the accelerated uh, budget, uh, reduced rate retreat um, workshop, and then the July retreat. Um, other than that, I want you guys to stay here. There will be more videos for me. Uh, more, you know, as the spirit strikes me, I love coming up on these, you know, on my groups and uh, answer questions. Ask me your questions, please. You're more than invited to go up on the group whenever you have a question and ask it. A lot of the time you will see that it inspires me. You know, those questions are usually very good. 
and they are usually interesting for more than just the one person that's commenting on the question. So uh, keep them coming and many times you will see that it inspires me to go up and do a live or do a video or do something on, on YouTube uh, to answer your questions. So I really hope that you guys continue to enjoy and to gain, uh, you know, to get benefit from these groups if uh, and from the, the, the challenge and from the free videos. I also hope that if you feel you want to do more work and you want to go uh, deeper into creating a healthy, joyful, self-compassionate writing practice for yourself that you would consider, you know, doing, you know, making that investment in your writing, in your mental health, in your emotional stability, in your ability to articulate uh, your, you know, your, your um, brilliant research in writing. Um, we um, will also look, you know, when you are in the, in the actual uh, programs, you know, we look at the style of your own writing and you always get really a lot of good feedback and ideas about how to just make it so that, you know, your writing just pops and sings off the page and is, you know, powerful and convincing and all the things that it needs to be for you to succeed and thrive. And please stay in touch. Don't be strangers. You know, this. I want to keep this group. I know it's like a daughter group of academic writers and blog, but I really am, um, you know, I'm really interested to keep this alive and there will be more things and events coming on this group. So thank you so much, everybody, for making this uh, challenge such a positive experience for me and such a success. It was a lot of hard work for me because uh, I was also stretching myself and growing and you know, uh, doing a lot of new things that I didn't do before, like forming all these websites just for this. Uh, that's a new thing for me. I really enjoyed it. It was a lot of work, but it made it worth it, you know. So hearing from you makes this um, worth my while. I really enjoy hearing that, you know, it worked. But even if it didn't work, right, tell me what's going on. I know that a lot of you got, you know, got going and got unblocked, but you can have relapses. So that's okay. Don't freak out if that happens. I'm here. My workshops are here. I'm here also for free. I'm always here, right? I'm on Academic Writers and Block. I'm on this group. So uh, just stay in touch. And uh, I hope that you uh, take advantage of the opportunity to re-watch for the last time the, the challenge free sessions by signing up. So that's going to be the free challenge one. Um, just the sign up and then you get the workbook and all of these things. Um, and then there will be information here about those other programs. If you yourself uh, don't feel like you need the, you know, the deeper dive or you don't need, you know, you can afford it, the time or the money right now, that's fine and great. No strings attached. Share the joy, you know, mention this to your friends, your blocked academic friends. Uh, mention it to your students and other people in your life that you know can benefit. So uh, I hope that that, um, you know, that you would consider doing that because, you know, that would help me help more people. All right, my friends, have a great weekend and make sure to sign up for the free challenge link uh, because there will be an email coming out shortly once I, I will give you guys some time. So maybe tomorrow over the weekend, I will send out uh, for the last time the links to rewatch the free challenge sessions. And with that, I will see you soon.